The U.S. military's Southern Command, or Southcom, will spend the EC $1.6 million to demolish and rebuild the Marine Police Pairs at Castries and View Fort. Officials say the construction will enhance the unit's capabilities to secure the island's porous borders and conduct counter-narcotics operations at sea. Police Commissioner Osbert Rager says the Marine unit must become the gatekeepers. If they are able to deal with issues before they get on our streets, then our ground forces, our ground units will not have that challenge. When we are affected on the street by items that come in through the water, we know that the first level of defense has been breached. This is not the first intervention the U.S. military has undertaken with the police. They have trained the tactical units of the police force like the Special Services Unit. Meanwhile, Major Edward Harvey praised the Marine units, saying he was impressed with the unit's interdiction of illegal drugs and weapons at sea. As we've seen time and again, the illicit trafficking that goes on, weapons, drugs, persons, it's a threat that confronts every country in the Eastern Caribbean. The U.S. government is glad to be able to provide this new pier, along with the new project for the breakwater and the in improvement to the pier in View Fort, in order to increase the capability of the police marine unit to counter threats to St. Lucia, in order to be an even stronger partner in the region. Commissioner Rages says that the marine unit is the first line of defense in the war against the illicit narcotics trade and gun running. He advised the contractor erect a structure that would stand the test of time and serve the police force in good stead. To ensure especially the St. Lucian contractors involved that we have a, um, a project that is going to serve us well into the future and help in your own protection. So you have a vested interest in ensuring that your work is a grid. Contracts for the work were awarded to Construction and Industrial Equipment Limited, a St. Lucia company. Work is scheduled to be completed by October. The pier in Castries was out of use due to severe damage, and the site in view fort was badly damaged by marine borer attacks. Officials say the dilapidated piers in their current state also pose a significant hazard to both vessels and members of the marine unit. Winston Springer Jr., HDS News, Channel 4.